what's good everybody welcome to the channel my name is franklin and today we're watching the guardian of words now if you're seeing me for the first time i hope it's not the last time but if you like reactions that are calm chill sometimes emotional <laughs> reactions that feel like you're sitting and watching a movie with a friend you're in the right place you're in the right channel i got so many movies and anime coming out so consider subscribing to all my returning viewers i missed you guys <laughs> let's get into this movie just like always not much is known about this movie i do not watch trailers or anything i just trust the voting that my subscribers do and my patrons and i just trust them and go for it so thank you for watching if you're here let's get into it i've started to get that good feeling in my gut that feeling before i start one of these anime movies i had that feeling before watching your name before watching a silent voice let's see what this movie got to offer mm, that looks beautiful うん。だから空の匂いを連れてきてくれる雨は好きで雨の朝はよく地下鉄には乗り換えずに改札を出るあ must be a park oh this is a beautiful park who is that is it love at first sight or confusion at first sight The scenery looks beautiful. I almost feel like I'm there. Is he an artist like me? Is he drawing her shoe? Chocolate <laughs> Chocolate and beer. <laughs> nice catch. I'm having a feeling this movie is just going to constitute of them having a conversation under this tent. And I'm and I'm here for it. <laughs> I'm here for it. Because you know if that's the case, then that conversation has to be so powerful in depth to last the whole movie. But let's see. Good job. Start the conversation. The ambiance is crazy. It's like I feel like I'm there. What is fitting? Hmm. So cryptic. Mm, I always love a nice intro card. A garden of words. Look how real those look. <laughs> Something I love is the lighting. Is that his dad? A roommate? <laughs> Dang. Okay, I got that all confused. That's definitely not his dad. <laughs> Probably an older brother. Yes. Wow, not only is he an artist, like a drawing artist, he carves as well. So big bro is moving out. A poem. That's the same thing she told him at the park. Mm. What should you be doing? Is he going to the park again? 
Yeah, he is. I like that though, because she almost, that was almost an invitation, right? Like, if it's raining again, would you stay here with me? So I guess he's answering the call. Wow, she is here. Oh. Are they going to have a conversation? Okay, sir. That's a, that's a bit um <笑>だサボっちゃった。で、朝から公園でビールを飲んでる。ね。だけてあんまり体に良くないですよ。何か食べないと。高校生が詳しいのね。あ、俺じゃなくて母が飲む人だから。My <笑> mom's the drinker. So she's obviously 食べる? Yikes. やばい女だって思ったでしょ。いや。どうせ人間なんてみんなどっかちょっとずつおかしいんだから。Hers is chocolate. Interesting. <laughs> I wonder what her deal is. What his deal is. Mm. Yeah, it's almost like an invitation. Mm. Mm, the OSTs. I feel that's one of the beautiful things that make these movies feel so alive. The music. I'll try to leave as much as I can in so YouTube don't slam me with copyrights. <laughs> They're meeting again. This is day three. Day four. If you notice, he's getting closer and closer to her with every day. Ah, he's a chef as well. Tuition? Is he going to art school? Mm. I love this idea of just meeting a random stranger and just forming a bond with them. I like that it feels so like it's one of the most natural things we could do, but I just love it. I don't think it happens often enough to just meet a random stranger and just converse about random things like beer, chocolate, school, being a shoemaker, you know? I think it's beautiful. Mm, his missing's cool because he's hanging with her. I love that though, he knows what's important to him. Oh my god, of course you're praying for rain. I remember being a teenager and having a crush on this one family friend of ours. And we used to go to church on Sundays and the night before or the morning before church, I remember myself just praying and hoping that she comes to church that Sunday. Because they were a family that came to church on and off and on and off. And when she came to church, oh man, I would be so happy because I get to talk to her. <laughs> so I can, I, I definitely feel that like being a teenager and just like praying for rain to come the next day so you can meet her in the woods or in the park. I just, I just love that concept. It's very realistic. Mm. うん。はっきりと分かっていることは2つだけ。あの人にとって15の俺はきっとただの書きだということ。Are <笑> She missed her train. Has she not been going to work as well? He's so close to her spot now. Mm. 
靴のデザインあっちょっと音に見せるもんじゃない<笑>そうですほらあっち座ってくれ<笑> sit down over there I get that as an artist not wanting people to see your work before it's complete that used to be before but 一緒にどうですありがとうでも私今日は自分の分持ってきたの Is it chocolate? <laughs> It's your own fault. Your standards are way too high. Tasting its own way. In case it's not clear yet, I'm enjoying this movie. <laughs> I'm enjoying the slow pace, the realism, the scenery. It's, it's just beautiful. Oh, look at this camera effect. Or is that him as a baby? Shoes. I wonder if that's where his love for shoes come from. Too late for me. What do you mean by that? <laughs> She has a taste disorder. Is she sick? Mm. Mm.。Wow. Yeah, she's definitely hiding something from him. I mean, which is fine, they just met, but. I hope she's not sick or extremely sick. I'm trying to predict where this movie is going, but I don't want to make sad predictions. I want to be very optimistic. Mm. He's making her shoes. Okay. Is he measuring her leg? Her feet. The highlights and the drawings are so remarkable. Mm. You really don't. Interesting. Right. Mm. <laughs> Not who she was expecting. Mm, it's a totally different vibe. September. It's been a couple of months. Because <laughs> he always had somewhere to be during the rainy days. That's her. That's her. That's so interesting. At least you know, now you know some of what she does. That's 
That's so sad. Yep, he's confronting them. Mm. Oh. Yikes. I did not expect any of this at all. Why do they keep calling her that word? Mm. Yeah, I mean, a relationship there would be inappropriate, but I get it. I mean, I guess he was more so standing up for her because something wrong was done to her. Not the fact that he's just this vengeful romantic you know that wants to protect her own honor or some fairy tale stuff like that <laughs> three bandages yikes oh he went there on a day that it's not rainy will she be there yeah it's very different when it's not raining for sure empty oh she is there so what, this is the first time they're meeting since the summer? Or before summer? A couple of months. Mm. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm. Right.でも君は違う世界ばっかり見てたのね。That's so interesting. So this whole time she worked at the school. Ah. But it makes sense that he never noticed her. He seemed like a guy who keeps to himself. I mean, half the time he's not even in school. <laughs> you know, he's working or he's at the park. So that makes sense that he never noticed her. Or he lied. <laughs> okay. Interesting, what a coincidence. It's gonna rain. A very heavy sudden rain too. And they don't have umbrellas. <laughs> Yikes. This is a darn near a storm. Drenched. Cold. I love these movies because they make you feel like you can live in these spaces. Everything looks so realistic, you know? They're cooking together. Yeah, that must be her place. Omelets. Those look so good. And obviously, just to clarify, elephant in the room, you would always catch me point out an inappropriate relationship in these movies whenever I see one. You know, having relationships with people who are underage. So 
just to be clear that's in the back of my mind but i am trusting the movie to not fall heavy into that trap but i'm enjoying it for what it is so far Hmm. He just up and said it. Mm. Hey guys, Edidin Franklin here. And trust me, I know in this scene there's a deeper message here about she mentioning she's learning to walk by herself, even though it's barefooted. And I know that's just a sweet metaphor for saying that over the months, the communication and relationship they've had has been helping her go through her life. But she moving away is her learning to walk by herself. And I know that there's a deeper metaphor here about him being a shoemaker and her learning to walk. Walk being her learning to continue living her life even without the good conversations and bond that they have created. Even though I'm a little bit creeped out by their age difference and him being a minor, I do appreciate that commentary being made i just wanted to mention that that i appreciate these things about the movie and its deeper themes okay back to the video akizuki And just to be clear, it's like loving someone is not wrong, especially how it happened in this movie. It happened organically. It's like there was nothing forced or anything. They seem like two really kind people, but at the end of the day, he is 15. And I appreciate her so much for being like, hey, it's Miss, you know, which is just a kind way to just shut it down and be like, hey, this can't happen even though she herself like appreciate his company and whatnot this cannot happen which i appreciate that a lot um because yeah a lot of negative things can come from here but i appreciate her just putting like a stop to it that hey this cannot happen and i'm sure he would understand <laughs> You did the right thing, girl. <laughs> Not to be negative or anything, but it's like anytime there is a relationship dynamic between an adult and a minor, I just can't ride with it a hundred percent based on like reality based on you know the problem we have with adults like having a relationship with minor is a very vast epidemic that we have in our society so like even though it is masked under a beautiful story like this it's like i can't get a hundred percent invested i hope that's not a bus kill but it's just it's just me being real and being honest it's like yes i'm glad she shut down the idea of a relationship with him but it's like still i mean it's almost like she didn't even want to make that decision and it just feels a little icky um but everything else i'm vibing with it Oh, 
Hello? Yikes. She's running after him. Yikes. That's so sad. I don't know how to feel about this. Well, I do know how to feel about this. It's like, I'm sorry, this is inappropriate. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I mean, it's beautiful. Like the sentiment is beautiful, but it's like I can't. No, he's he's a child. He's a minor. And please don't come in the comments with the, um, in Japan the legal age is this or that. I am not. Yeah, I'm not riding with that. It's like, cause he even mentioned it there. He's like, you knew I was a kid. Like you knew I was a student. It's like, how could you? Were you just like leading me on? Were you just capitalizing on someone's fantasies? So I, this would be perfect if they were both that young or if they were both older, you know? Maybe if he was in college and he was like 18 plus, but like the whole high school setting him being 15 year old, it didn't just, it didn't just work. It didn't just work for me. And that, that sucks so bad. Cause like, I love and enjoyed like most of it. But anytime the whole thing came up about like the relationship, I'm like, uh -huh. yeah. And someone in my comments, one of my friend in my comments, he warned me about this movie. He's like, Franklin, you've watched Violet Evergarden and there's some things you didn't like in that show. So you might not like it in this show. I guess, I guess I just wanted to give it a chance. But yeah, the whole thing with an adult having a romantic relationship with a minor. It's like, what was the message here? You know, and I'm sorry if I sound all doom and gloom. And if you like this movie, like I respect your opinion and all that. It's just, it's one of those things where I can't separate this fiction from real life because I know all the things that happen in real life with like you know predators and you know people seeking minors and stuff like that so even in a movie like this where it seems quote unquote not as aggressive or innocent in a sense there's like some grooming aspect in this so i'm sorry if this wasn't the reaction you were hoping for but i have to be honest when i'm making these to how i feel the song slaps though Mm. How is she doing? But yeah, positives. The scenery in this movie was amazing. The weather scenes were amazing. The establishing shots, creme de la creme. So many great things about this movie. One thing that would have made this movie perfect for me is if he was older like he was legal if he wasn't in high school and he was in college it would be perfect if he was at least like 18 or 19 or 20 that's even weird saying you know <laughs> that's so weird it's just the age gap is crazy it's crazy and i don't want to make that argument but it's like some of the things she was doing yes maybe she was lonely she needed a companion and whatnot but it's like a high schooler is not the answer you know 
I even feel weird about having friends who are that young, like just friends. I feel so weird about it because I'm like, our lives are not even compatible. Like, what are we even going to talk about or, you know? I'm a teacher and I teach kids, I teach teenagers, I teach adults. And it's like, there's some conversations I can't even have with teenagers because like they're, they're just young. We shouldn't even be, you know, that close to begin with. You know, I prefer like having adult friendships because like our lives matches and whatnot. But besides that, this movie was great. This movie was a good movie. That just soiled it a little bit for me. Which comes back to my questions, like, what was the message here, you know? It's like, what was the movie trying to say? That relationships like that can't happen, but you can persevere and make it happen. But shout out to her for shutting it down, though. But, yeah, this is the weirdest reaction I've ever done. (laughs) Because people expect reactions to be all positive and all that, but I'm just speaking my truth about this one. Oh, he's there during the winter. Mm. Oh, he made her shoes for her. クレンシオしていたのはきっと俺も同じだと今は思ういつかもっともっと遠くまで歩けるようになったら会いに行こう。as a wrap thanks for watching i always appreciate these conversations that can be had while watching these movies thanks for tuning in hit that like button consider subscribing to see more reactions like this and let me know your thoughts in the comments also let me know some of your recommendations in the comments peace